Alright. Which one will we pick? <laughs> the dog head fish. Dog fish head. Or oh, dog here fish we go. Head. I don't know what I'm talking about. I forgot what we were doing, cram it. <laughs> All right. Okay. Hi, I'm in Delaware. This is nice. This is Why do I say this? Because this week's edition of the Brew Review, this is where this beer is based out of. It is Dogfish Head Craft Brewed Ales. It's a Tweezin' Ale. Tweezin' Ale. Tweezin' Ale, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Well, this is based out of Rehoboth Beach, Delaware. Yes. Established in 1995. Brewed in 95. A gluten-free, sorghum-based ale brewed with strawberries... And buckwheat honey. Strawberries? Yes. Yeah, so I wonder see. if there's even a hint of strawberry you in that. You see the little strawberry with the little face down there. Look like a bumblebee. Focus. Come on, focus, damn focus! it. Focus! <laughs> oh, whatever. I'll... Focus! There we go. And then you got, like, the little fish cap, which is it's pretty like cool. Shark. What does that look like? Oh! Oh! Sorry, I just defended. Would you please? <laughs> Would you please? I just had to add something stupid to we this We are thing. doing mature scientific research here, okay? Well, that was scientific. Nutrition facts. Nutrition <laughs> facts. GMC's pissed off now. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, nutri cal 170 calories. So this will probably kill you. Yeah. Uh, Not only will it uh, kill your liver, it'll make you fat. It has 1% protein. One gram of protein. Yeah. 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 So let's take a... Closer look at the facts. Hmm. You don't see tr nutrition facts on a beer very often. No, we don't. We saw. One Let's see. Time. Brewed and bottled by Dogfish Head Craft Brewery, Incorporated, Milton, Delaware. Yep. Which I'm assuming that's near Rehoboth Beach. Yeah. The first. Well, the first brewery was in '95 in Rehoboth. So I'm sure they've expanded by then. But they. So said, just north of Ocean City. They said uh, on the website there are what 25 different states. Yes, they probably cover almost as much territory, if not more, than Yingling. Mm -hmm. 6% alcohol content. Yeah, so it's it's decent. And it's certified gluten-free. Yeah, like you Like I said, that? if you don't like your glutens in your beer, this is the good stuff. Alright, so we're going to do the cap test, the body and head test, the taste test, after burp, and all that good stuff. The draft test. Ingredients. Water, sorghum syrup, strawberries, honey, hops, and yeast. There better be a hint of strawberry in here, otherwise I will be pissed. Alright, so, the cap test. <clears throat> no. No go. No. So, no, no, no. as tradition, we get the opener. I dropped the opener trying to be cool and flip it around like this and like... Like that, like Whoops. a butterfly, like a butterfly knife, you know, like you're screwing it up. <laughs> like a but. I'm gonna stop doing that and just open the damn bottle. How's that? Yeah, I think our viewers will agree. They're probably there, like get to the fucking point. <laughs> They're probably throwing their beers at their monitors right now. It hissed. It hissed. It hissed. Hmm. You'll have to either confirm or deny this. I do. It has a sweeter smell to it. Really? Here, let's. Uh, let me try this here. Uh, I'm. I swear, it's like a sweeter smell. Don't stuff it right up your nose. You gotta waft it. You have to be cultural about this. It's not a bad smell. It's no, it, rather it's, different. Which makes me wonder if uh, it's going to be good or bad, because it could be bad. The smell could be deceiving sometimes, as we've learned. See, he shoves it up his damn nose. I waft it, because I'm sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Yes. Because I, I raised my pinky. Yes. Mm -hmm. And here we go. Dogfish Head Craft Brew Ales Tweezin' Ale. Let's try it. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, well, no strawberries. No strawberry taste. Damn it! And it's a very hoppy, a drier ale taste to it. It was like uh, Old Speckled Hen, where my fir the first drink I took just totally took... Old speckled ass. <laughs> yeah, it just totally dried my mouth completely out. But second, second sway, maybe it'll redeem itself. Mm. <clears throat> I'm kind of. I'll eat a minute. You try it. I gotta formulate my opinion. All right. Dogfish Head Craft Brew Ales Tweezinal Tweezinal. Let's try it. Shuffle this nose up it again. Mm. Okay, we'll try the second. Second one. Uh, it's not bad. Uh, I like it. It's it's okay. It's nothing to write home about. Although no strawberries anywhere in that taste. I wish it had strawberry. It, it has plenty of sorghum. Whatever sorghum tastes like. I'm sure it has plenty of it. I don't taste a hint of strawberries or honey. So, you lied, dogfish head. You lied. Right. Good? Indifferent? Not bad. I don't know how to describe it, but it wasn't bad. Shrimp? Okay. No, it wasn't shrimp. So we're going to pure. Ooh. Oh. Hmm. Ooh, that, uh, that's got some decent head to it. Yes, I poured it very well. Well, uh... That's apple cider. Yes. Apple if you want to compare anything other than soda. Cream soda. Cream, cream soda, apple cider taste, or not taste, but look to <laughs> it. Mm. Lighter than, uh, our last ale we did was a little darker. Very see throughable if that's even a word. <laughs> wow. This, <laughs> must, this must be what it looks like when you're drunk, like really hammered. I got a stupid random thought. If you get a pair of drunk goggles and you get, like, freaking hammered up, does it even itself out? Can you see straight again when you wear them? You have to try that out. But here it's we go. Theory. Draft test. Hemorrhoid. <laughs> I'm I'm starting to think that this is a lot like old speckled hen, just because it's okay. I mean, I actually liked it, but we'll see with the draft test old, here. I did not like old speckled. Ooh, look, uh, there's bubbles rising. See that? Mm -hmm. You see that, folks? Yeah, I see it right here. It's I nice. seen it. I seen it. I actually prefer this more than old speckled hen. You want some? No, that's not. Hemorrhoid. Right. You want some? No. Okay. Uh. What do you think? Not bad. Eh, take the I'll, last little. I'll take the last little swig. It's probably all the weast is probably down in here. It's okay. I, I'd get a six. I see where you're coming from, where you kind of compare it to Old Speckled Hen, but Old Speckled Hen, even when I drank more of it, it didn't do anything for me. It, like, it still tasted bad. This is kind of a growing on type beer. You see, I liked it the whole way through, so I, I could do a sixer. I'm still disappointed. No strawberry taste. So, my personal rating, I'm going to say hmm. 3.5 out of 5 on that one. Wow. I'm going to go... So I'm, it's about a thumbs <laughs> diagonal up. I'll go about 2.5. About a... Like a... Uh, not, my, not my favorite, but I've definitely had worse. Yes. I've had way worse than this one. I think... I mean, if I was to compare with Old Speckled Hen, like we have been on this, it's better than that. 
Mm -hmm. I think so. Definitely, definitely way better. Has a little bit of a sweeter taste to it. Not yeah, much, but maybe that's the, maybe the strawberries give it that sweet taste. Yeah, you ever think of that? There's sorghum in there. <laughs> yeah, whatever sorghum tastes like. Everybody want, knows what sorghum tastes like. But right dogfish head, craft brewed ales, Tweezinol. I love it. Yeah, it's good. Not, not bad. Terrible. Not terrible, I should say, but not the best. It's passable. We'll say that. But there you go. That's your episode, Delaware, and... I'm in Delaware. Yay. Yeah, we kind of passed through that going to Ocean City, but that's a whole other topic. But anyway, stay tuned for more Brew Review, and we have more coming to you very shortly. And we'll see you next week.